Hey guys, so today I'm here with Jill Thomas. She owns Ultimate Boot Camp in Boston, and today we're going to be debunking what boot camp actually is and whether or not your butt can handle it. But first, I'm excited to announce that on this Saturday, April 27th, Jill and myself and a bunch of other amazing brands, Queen of Objects, are going to be part of a fabulous event featuring fitness outside, enjoying the best that Boston has to offer. So Jill, you guys are going to be offering a 45 minute fitness class and what else is going to be there? I'm really excited, Sierra, because I've been in the fitness industry for 15 years and I've hosted a lot of events and this is the first time that I've been a part of hosting an event that really encompasses an entire sitting. So Ultimate Bootcamp will be hosting 45 minute outdoor fitness classes for free to the entire community. We also brought in a few of our fitness partners. So we'll have yoga, we'll have kickboxing, we'll have Zumba. And it's just a really great way to get people outdoors in Boston, enjoying the sunshine, enjoying spring. And it's called the Ultimate Spring Workout. Mm -hmm. Like you said, it'll be held on Saturday the 27th from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. And it's free. So if people just want to RSVP, it's ultimatespringworkout.com. And there's also, like you said, Pop Chips is going to be there showing you guys how to eat healthier in the summer because we're going to be doing boot camp to get in shape for bikini season. Pop Chips, half the fat, half the calories. My go-to snack when I'm on the beach and I want a salty craving. Um, and you've worked with Pop Chips as well in the past, so you're probably excited. So. We have. We worked with Pop Chips uh, a few times in the past, and although they're not based in Boston, they've been such a part of the Boston community, and they've really kind of taken it as their home. Uh, and we're really excited to be working with them to donate $2 for every attendee to the Ultimate Spring Workout to One Fun Boston, which, as we know, the horrible events that happened on Monday, it'll be going towards a really great cause. So we want to make sure to get as many people attending the Ultimate Spring Workout as possible. I'm super excited to be involved in this, and I haven't done a lot of events in Boston, so this is one of my first, so I'm really excited. So if you guys live in the area, come on down. I'd love to meet you. So now, down to what people really want to know. What is a boot camp class actually like? And are people going to be puffing and puffing the entire time, or what is it? Well, I actually think you could probably speak to a little bit of this, because Sarah's actually joined us at a boot camp workout a couple years ago now. Mm -hmm. So what was your initial impression? It was a very challenging, and I was sore, but it wasn't like a 60 minute class where you didn't have a second to catch your breath. It was structured in kind of uh, segments. You know, I think the one that I did was, uh, it was a ladder, I think, and we did. We started with 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. We went all the way up to 100. We did a different move for each one. And so it was challenging, but I was expecting burpee after burpee after mountain climber. <laughs> so it wasn't, it was an amazing workout. I burned a ton of calories and I was sore, but it wasn't as miserable as I thought it well, was going to be. Just it wasn't the thing. That's just the thing. At Ultimate Boot Camp, we really tried to make it a positive experience for people. You First of all, you had the courage to come out. And it was early. And it was early. So you don't want to be in a situation where you've finally gotten yourself out of your bed and you're sweating your pajamas in the morning and get out there and just be yelled at and be yeah. kind of miserable that you're not able to do those kinds of workouts. So. At Ultimate Boot Camp, we run four-week outdoor fitness programs, so it increases from week one to week four. The classes get more intense, so as you get stronger, the classes get a little bit more challenging, and the trainers are really awesome about adapting the workload mm -hmm. to whatever fitness level is out there. And that's the key, is finding a boot camp instructor you can really mesh with. And it is, it's still kind of like a small group training aspect, it's almost kind of like you have a personal trainer, so if you can't afford a personal trainer, something like a boot camp that's with a small group is going to be really beneficial for you, especially if you're an, a beginner, because it is, it's suitable for beginners, intermediates, and advanced, right? Absolutely, all fitness levels, and again, it's, it's the trainers, they're so motivating, and they want you to do well, they yeah. want you to succeed, so to provide that positive environment for, for you to work out, it's really important. So if you live in Boston and you've never tried boot camp before, come on down on Saturday, April 27th. Hopefully we calmed your nerves if you were a little bit nervous. And also when you come down on Saturday, you're going to be able to try some of the new pop chips tortilla. They're keeping it fresh with some new flavors. And also they have the new Katie's kettle corn, which I'm super excited about. I love Katy Perry and I love kettle corn. Obviously, I'm going to love the two combined. And don't forget your attendance. Pop Chips and, uh, and Ultimate Boot Camp are going to donate $2 to the uh, one, one Fund Boston organization. So thanks for watching, guys. Leave your comments below, and we'll see you soon.